I can't wait to hear. Courtney Dempsey standing by with your Hollywood headlines. Nah, you don't have to wait too long. I'm about to break it to you right now. I People magazine smells what The Rock is cooking, and they think it's pretty smoking hot. The magazine is named Mr. Dwayne The Rock Johnson. As it's uh, this year's sexiest man alive, the former wrestler turned Hollywood A-lister is a busy guy. He's currently starring in the HBO series Ballers as well as co-starring in the Fast and Furious franchise. And he's lending his voice to the upcoming Disney animated film Moana. Yeah. Johnson told the magazine that his new title makes him feel like he's reached the pinnacle. <laughs> yeah. Doesn't get better than that. So busy. Yeah. I know. He's so <laughs> big. Look at him. Kevin Hart. It's like, <laughs> so funny. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to be like him. Little guy. Oh. Aww, little guy. Yeah. All right. A familiar face is going to be making a cameo in the upcoming Ocean's Eleven spinoff movie. Matt Damon. Matt Damon says he's returning to the franchise in the upcoming Ocean's 8. The actor told Entertainment Tonight that he'll have a small part in the film, but he didn't reveal exactly what that might be. Ocean's 8 follows an all-female heist gang and boasts a ton of star power, including Oscar winners Sandra Bullock, Kate Blanchett, and Anne Hathaway. The film is set to hit theaters in June of 2018. Oh, hope it's good. Please yeah, be good. Say, that's going to yeah. be a good one. Yeah. Now, once upon a time, Fifty Shades Darker was the most viewed movie trailer online. Oh, but it has been dethroned mm. by none other than the trailer for Beauty and the Beast. Oh, thank God. Oh. Yay. <laughs> You see that one coming? Yeah. We first showed you this yesterday, and within the past 24 hours, it has been viewed 127.6 million times. Fifty Shades Darker received only 114 million views. Disney's Beauty and the Beast hits the big screen next year. Oh, that'd be great. All right, brace yourselves, 90s fans. The biggest boy band of the 90s is hitting the road. Look at Ortiz is giddy right now because I mean, the new kids on the block has still got the right stuff and they're taking it on a massive tour. The Total Package Tour kicks off next May and it will hit more than 40 cities, including Sacramento. But they're not doing it alone. Boys to Men and Ooh. Paula Abdul are joining a special guest. Oh, oh, wait, oh, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you know the dance that goes with it. Right stuff. <laughs> the new kids are going to swing by Golden One Center on June 3rd, and tickets go on sale this Saturday. Hulis has got her charge card ready to go. Oh, yeah, pre sales today. Pre sales today. Pre sale. Oh, pre sale starts today. Just letting you know. Yes, there you go. Now, as we mentioned, Boys to Men is going to be joining new kids on the tour along with uh, Paula Abdul. But Boys to Men is hanging out with us first before they hit the tour. Nathan and Wanye Morris will be joining us live during the 7 o'clock hour, so be sure to tune in and hear all about the boys' latest animated project. What are the chances we get him to sing a little bit? Oh, man. Could you? Ooh, ooh. That would be pretty okay. amazing if we could. Well, let's try. We let's see go if we can pull it. that off. We should probably <laughs> start small. Like, you know, maybe hit him with a, like, a, like a little Christmas jingle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, talk yeah, about yeah. that, you know? Yeah, they did see have a Christmas first. album. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. So we'll see. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you got to trick him. You're right. <laughs> All right. Awesome.